Hi, so this is just going to be a really mini haul. Um, nothing too exciting. Uh, first of all, I want to share that my phone case is done. So this is what it looks like up close. I did have a picture of it on my Instagram. But this is it live. So this is the silicone decadent thing. And there's a bunch of little things pushed in there. And I think it turned out really cute. This is the front of the case. It's purple. And it made my phone really heavy. <laughs> but it's still cute. And I'm still going to try and see if I can handle it. It's not too bad when you hold on to it. But it's just kind of like, whoa, you know. It's really cool, though. It's really cute. So that's that. And I'm about ready to post something on Instagram. Anyway, so I also bought another case with the Dollar Tree. I do not own an iPhone, but I'm thinking about making it just for practicing sake. And actually, no, it wasn't the Dollar Tree. It was 25 cents at Walmart. What's wrong with me? Anyway, just to practice and maybe sell it. I don't know. Or if any of you have a iPhone 5 slash 5s maybe I can make it for you I don't know I don't know when I'll be able to send it because I'm broke right now but you know if anybody does have one of those and would like me to try to make something for them I will you know so that's that and then today I got two nail polishes that were 99 cents a piece and which is really awesome because I originally saw this um, color at Rite Aid and it was two two something and it is sinful colors in the shade let me go and I just thought it was really pretty the camera is not doing it justice but it's kind of like one of those two three tone um, shades it's really kind of it looks purple but it looks like it has gray and green in it um, I'll probably do a nail polish review on on these later. And because they were 99 cents at Walgreens, I was able to get two. And I saw one I hadn't seen before, and this one's called Bali, Bali Mist. And this one's a lot more pink, like a pink-purple shade. It's very shiny, very pretty. And so I'm really happy with those. I'll take a picture of them on my Instagram and show you guys so you can really see what the bottles look like the colors so those nail polishes and then also at Walgreens I could not pass this up it was a dollar 67 on clearance it's so pretty it's a journal didn't really need a journal but I love journals and it's actually fabric as you can see it's kind of raised it's like a quilted feeling kind of puffy and on the way home I was like it's like a bed I want to sleep on it or like a pillow or a quilt <laughs> it's just really nice it's 80 pages and it has just little flower designs on it so whenever I get started on writing again then yeah I'll write in there but I just thought it was really lovely never seen one like that before for such a good price and then two more things. I went to Goodwill yesterday and I didn't have any money, but today I did. And um, so today I went back because I, the thing I saw yesterday, I couldn't afford. Obviously, I just said that. I'm sorry, I'm kind of distracted tonight. Um, and I'm really happy to get it. These are the Crayola Twistables. It's a. Uh, pencils and shades set. It, I don't think I have the, it didn't come with the pencils, which I don't care. It's fine. I got plenty of pencils, but I love these. I use these. They're like colored um, pencil slash crayons, and I use these for my comics and my art, and um, every time I color, I use these for everything that I, I draw. So I have some, but I wanted some extra ones because I'm missing some and because I really needed some browns for my current comic. So yay, that was $2.99. I was really happy that it was still there because I kind of hid it. 
because sometimes I do that and things aren't there, but I kind of hit it and I found it and I was like, yes, it's still there. There was something else I wanted, but I really couldn't afford to get it. It was a pirate game and I really wanted it, but I had to be careful with my money. And then lastly, I got a piece of black felt because I need it because I'm going to line the inside of my Monster High lunchbox, which I hauled quite a while ago. Um, just trying to get it open. So I'm going to line the inside with felt. I probably need a second piece of felt. But again, I was trying to save money. And I know felt's only 23 cents, but, you know, I wanted money for something else. Um, so I'm going to line it on the top and the bottom. I was hoping to get some red, but they didn't have any red. That was another reason why I didn't get second felt. But the bottom is probably going to have black, and then the top will have red. And then I'll just use this as an example. I have this little mirror I'm going to put up here somewhere and decorate this all. And it's going to be like a little lunchbox purse. So I'm really looking, at, looking forward to doing that. Looking excited. I can't talk tonight. And, um... Yeah, that'll be my cute little purse. And when that's all done, which is probably going to be a while, I will show that to you guys and probably end up in an outfit of the day. And lastly, I forgot to show is this bracelet that I'm wearing. I just found it at Walmart. They had several of them. They're so cute. They had owls, uh, monkeys, skulls, and I want to say flowers, but I'm not sure. See, do you see the monkeys? They almost look like Flintstone vitamins. <laughs> and they're really cute. And all the colors are supposed to represent something. Like, I think this one's loyalty, but I just got it because it was purple. And I love monkeys. So anyway, that was my mini haul. Thanks for watching. Later.